was a normal typical day you know we do lots of transactions for customers and it just so happened that a customer had come in asking to make a transfer out of his account that immediately to myself seemed rather unusual the customer had, was saying that he wanted to transfer the money to his daughter-in-law um, as it was something that was completely you know out of the blue that he wouldn't normally do I then asked further questions in regards to well you know why is it you know you're sending that money is it for something in particular you know and the customer told me that it was for um, purchasing a property I told the customer I was going to get the manager but by this time I had already decided that I was going to invoke police banking protocols so um, I was able to contact the police on a designated your, your phone 999 it is deemed as an emergency to get the police to come out just so that I had some backup because I did feel the customer was being scammed at that precise moment and it was really important that the police came so that we could speak to the customer and try and get to the bottom of it and that's when the customer just told us that he'd been contacted in the morning you know we'd been contacted various times and also he told us that there was a taxi waiting outside for him. The fraudsters had actually, contact, had actually contacted a local taxi company and had booked a taxi for the customer to come down, which was still nearly half an hour later sitting outside waiting for him. We understand these people who are phoning you are professionals. These people, their job is to scam you out of money. And that's why they seem so professional, so plausible. Everything they're saying, they absolutely people believe that person could be calling from the bank.